we uh, got on scene this evening around 7.30 and uh, did a preliminary assessment with the uh, fire chief. <clears throat> the storm that uh, Godrich experienced at around 4 o'clock this afternoon was indeed a tornado. Uh, our role now is to determine the strength of that tornado. The uh, preliminary reports that I've seen so far and the damage that we've uh, been able to take a look at and photograph uh, puts us in mind of a high-end Fujita Strength 2 tornado, possibly Fujita Strength 3. That would put the wind speed somewhere between 250 to 300 kilometers per hour. Um, I will tell you that the last Fujita Strength uh, tornado that we had in Ontario occurred on uh, April the 20th, 1996. There were two F3 tornadoes on that day. Uh, one was in Williamsford in Gray County. The other one was a, uh, an F3 tornado that went from Arthur in Wellington County to Violet Hill in Dufferin County. So it's been 15 years since Ontario has seen an F3 tornado. Um, it does indeed appear to be of that strength of a tornado here in Godrich. Uh, the downtown core appears to be uh, very uh, devastated. <clears throat> a, lot of, uh, a lot of vehicle damage, upper story damage, roof damage, uh, large brick buildings have been destroyed. And uh, we will be doing a more detailed uh, assessment of the storm tomorrow. We have asked for a second and possibly a third team to come in and uh, do the damage survey. Uh, one to do extensive damage here in the town of Godridge. One to pick up the trail as it left Godridge and moved southeastwards. And uh, we will have uh, another team or two tomorrow to continue the investigation. <clears throat> Um, we'll have a better idea at that time as to the full strength of the storm. So uh, any findings that we're giving you tonight are certainly preliminary and subject to change, but it, it does appear to be a high-end F2 or a low-end F3, and once again, around 250 to 320 uh, kilometers per hour. <clears throat>